That day is Thursday, the 26th of January. Uh, went up to the uh, factory to further assist them. Uh, more adjustments and uh, still chasing the problem. And uh, step back, scratch my head for a minute, pulling on 50 years of experience and identified the problem. It's a micro adjustment. Uh, made the report to the maintenance man and the owner that's down here this week. Okay, we'll take it from here. You know, yeah, whatever. So anyway, I told him I'd be down here in my little building. And uh, they're getting by and need me, just come get me. So, uh, finished drilling my little plates. And uh, it's a process remove the sliding panel clean everything real good and get all the sealant off there's also tar that they attempted to use back in the day on the outside of the sliding door area and chisel all that stuff out and put the panel up now this one does not look level because it's not again the floor slopes and i need it hard against the floor to further try to seal these things so that's what I'm doing it's going to take uh, one tube of uh, self-leveling dicor for two panels all right so a half a tube per panel and about the same on this good silicone I've been using about a half a tube per panel so I need six tubes pretty easy to do the math and I don't have six tubes. I need to get three more of the die core. Uh, nope. One more of the die core, probably two be on the safe side. And I get four more of the good silicone. Have a little bit of extra, better too much, not enough. So I'll put that on my shopping list. And it's it, it, not a long process. It's just I remove the old, uh, set the new panel in place after I chisel out all the sealant. Then uh, anchor it in place with one bolt. Then go back and drill the rest of the holes. Take the panel back off, uh, sweep and clean the surfaces, get rid of any of the uh, dust from the drill operation on drilling through the block, put on the sealant, and then uh, put the panel back on. So I'm going to probably figure 30 minutes per panel. I ain't under no deadline. So I'm going to take my time. And then, uh, but I'll probably do this second one here. And yeah, wife's up here. She had a problem with her phone. Had to go to Verizon and get that sorted out. So again, you know, it's it really ain't no big deal just time consuming and got rain coming again uh, here in a few days uh be a real good time to check for leaks so anyway that's what i'm doing and uh i guess that's about all for this one uh -huh. came in this morning it was 28 degrees here in northeast texas and the building was still comfortably warm from what little bit i ran the heater yesterday and I left out of here about 5 o'clock in the evening, turned the heater off. And uh, like I said, come in this morning, it was still comfortably warm. Cranked on the heater, set it on 70. I had turned the dang thing off, I started sweat. Got some doors opened up, getting in some fresh air. So, anyway, that's all for this one. Thank you.